All right, welcome back to Crypto Front. This is the front line where we are fighting for financial freedom. I'm going to be giving you a quick update here on Casper. I think that uh, I'm almost a little bit late to this update here because things are moving very, very fast here for the Casper price set. There is an opportunity. And if you are somebody like me who likes to take these kind of opportunities in the market, we are talking about something like at least a 40% pump or something like an 80% pump here coming out of Casper. I'm going to be seizing that opportunity definitely. I don't want to let this one go. So if you like that, I want to kindly ask you to help me spread the video just by delicately tapping the like button. It really helps the YouTube algorithm. And people looking for Casper updates will now be able to find this video much more easily. If you're new to the channel, I want to kindly ask you to subscribe as well because we do TA on a number of other different different outcomes on a regular basis. You know what, without me further running my mouth too much, let's get right into what Casper is doing right at this point. And I think that right at this point, it's very much easy to see that we've got this symmetrical triangle here. And uh, usually these are continuation patterns, right? Continuation in which direction you may be asking. I think it's also very much clear that we are having like a very nice uptrend here. So the most likely thing to happen here is that we have a huge break here off of this resistance that we are seeing here, a downward stopping resistance. And uh, where exactly will we be hating? Usually, I mean, technically speaking, you want to be taking the thickest part of the symmetrical triangle from the very top right there to, you know, from the very bottom, actually, to the very top there. You are looking at something like a 40%. I was just mentioning at the very beginning of the video. And um, that will be a price to get of around 27 cents here for Casper. I think it's great. Maybe for some people, 40% is not all that good. But I can tell you that just look around in other markets on planet earth right you're not going to be finding this kind of returns that much easily right so this is like a preliminary price target just looking at the symmetrical triangle here on casper but i, I think that uh you know it's almost like an underestimate as well but if you're looking for short-term gains maybe you're you're going to be entering a leverage trade or something like that this is really really cool right but still I'm taking a look at this whole structure here and i'm saying that look what we are seeing here with casper where we see the price setting a new high here like hitting low again and then coming back to test the previous high like one two three times here we have seen something like this back then in something like uh, september october last year where we were having this high here we we said try to set another one we got rejected we tried one more time got even sent lower and then we have got another try here and then boom we had a very huge a very huge rally right now you may say it was something like here from the point of break to wait you know initially stopped that's something like a 200 percent almost but still that also even went higher to something like you know what a 250 percent or stuff like that so yeah should we be expecting something like this here to happen one more time to be honest with you i think that there is a likelihood of something happening here we could literally see a very violent breakout of this whole thing here but the question there obviously is where exactly would we be likely heading right so i mean we are going to be taking a look at a specific pattern right there right which is actually very much popular and uh, you know i'm just gonna you know show you right away here this is something like a cup and handle formation where you can see that this is the cup here let's just go ahead and map our handle here in which we would be seeing something like this right there right so we have a perfect cup and handle formation here and uh, the way to measure like the technical price target of something like this here you could try to be as conservative as possible obviously you would be measuring the depth of the handle here and uh, to the point of breakout which really to be honest with you is just as similar to measuring like the technical price they got of the symmetrical triangle there so there is no need to do that one more time but if you want to be as bullish as possible you are measuring like the depth of this cup here so you are looking at something like here from the very bottom here where the casper price was setting its low to the point of breakout we are looking at a pump of something like 91 percent and uh, that will be taking the Casper price to something like 37 cents in the immediate short term. These are not long term price targets, like obviously, but just considering what we are having locally here, right at this top here, I think that something like a 90% pump is something that is very, very much likely for Casper. And I am willing to be taking some kind of a risk or, you know, just trying to evaluate this opportunity here. I'm already in a trade. Maybe I should have actually made this update a little bit earlier on, but really, I think it doesn't make any difference. The price could still pull back a little bit, maybe do something like 18, 17 cents. And uh, that will actually be even a much better chance to get into Casper right there. So right at this point, we've got two very important patterns here, the cup and handle formation, also coming into confluence with the symmetrical tying right there. All this is trying to say is that, look, there is almost little doubt right at this point that Casper is very much bullish. And uh, I'm very much looking forward to this breakout here that we're going to be having in the coming maybe few weeks or something. I, I don't expect this to take months. Let me just be clear with that. I expect this to take like at least days or maybe 
a few weeks right till we get like the price that gets hit we can also pretty much see the same kind of trajectory being drawn here if we take a look at this kind of a ribbon that i was drawing here and uh, it's basically just you know showing the boundaries in which uh, a caspa is moving by right? so you can see here for example you touch the slow here you head for another high you touch the low you i mean it's just kind of a cycle right we touch the low one more time here so we'll be looking to be hitting at the top uh, right around here something like you know 40 cents or something like that but still that is still below the price targets that we are targeting here so i think as long as we are within that that range the price targets are still conservative and we can have a fantastic price section showing up right there taking a look at a few indicators as well we can see here that the rsi is still pretty much healthy right but the moment here we break and close above something like 70 on a weekly time frame i think we actually have a much more powerful move coming here for casper right but just to put more emphasis we are seeing that even the rest of the market is looking like it has got this bullish flag that is threatening to break out any moment from now i mean there was a massive demand candle here so if we have got like this break happening for the rest of the market as well what we are looking at right now is the crypto total market cap and uh, yeah should we have a breakout right there the market is going to go bananas i'm telling you right we are looking at a price target of something like seven trillion for the rest of the market and be rest assured that caspa is going to be having a much bigger say in all of those things happening right there so basically these are the things that i'm looking forward to obviously remember none of what i say is financial advice and you shouldn't be buying or selling anything because of anything i sell right but if you like the content don't forget to delicately tap the like button share the video with your friends and family and then i would have to see you on the very next one take really really good care of yourselves bye